Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. Counting on the truth behind Jessa Duggar's lazy parenting. Counting on alum Jessa Duggar Seewald has faced controversies over the years for her parenting. The 31-year-old mom has been accused of exploiting her kids to endorse products and programs on social media. But it's not the only issue Ben's wife has faced. Some Redditors even recalled hearing she has lazy parenting. Keep reading to see the discussion. Jessa is back on social media sharing fun content about her family. Last week, the Counting on alum admired her husband, Ben, for being the best cook, adding that he made a fantastic spread for their home date. This also shuts down the speculation that the two are facing marital issues. Even Jinger and Jeremy chimed in on the controversy on their recent podcast, saying that the rumors about Ben and Jessa were all false. Some Redditors discussed Jessa's parenting and why she has faced many issues over the years. According to some, the counting on alum allegedly blanket-trained her kids, which is a questionable parenting practice. Others also recalled the time when she posted a video in her house where 10 diapers were piled onto her dresser, and people were disgusted by it. This made some fans think Jessa Duggar Seewald is a lazy parent. Others also called her out for her lazy birthday presents for her kids, which all came from Amazon. Jessa Duggar Seewald also made headlines last September for sharing family photos in which some of her kids suspiciously covered her. This made some counting on fans speculate that she may be pregnant with a sixth child. According to some, Jessa is long overdue if she's following a certain pattern of giving birth to kids. However, Jessa later took to the comments section of her post to tell a fan that she wasn't pregnant, adding that she only had too much ice cream on their vacation. Jessa Duggar Seewald, familiar to fans from Asterisk 19 Kids and Counting Asterisk and Asterisk Counting on Asterisk, has grown up in the limelight, managing the delicate balance of public scrutiny and personal life under the watchful eye of reality television viewers. Now a mother to four, Jessa has been a topic of both admiration and criticism when it comes to her approach to parenting. In recent years, an unexpected narrative has emerged surrounding Jessa's so-called lazy parenting. This term, laden with judgment, requires a deeper dive into what it really means, whether it's fair, and how Jessa's response reflects the changing landscape of modern parenthood. Hashtag, 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 a glimpse into Jessa's parenting. Jessa and her husband, Ben Seewald, share a life that might seem idyllic from the outside. Family gatherings filled with laughter, playful children, and a home bursting with life and activity. However, social media, a powerful yet double-edged tool, has opened windows into their day-to-day -day lives, leading to unfiltered opinions from viewers around the world. The crux of the criticism stems from moments captured online where Jessa appears to take a more laid-back approach to discipline or organization. For instance, in various vlogs and Instagram stories, viewers have noted her relaxed attitude when her children scatter toys across the living room, leave laundry unfolded, or enjoy meals with a degree of chaos that to some signifies neglect. Yet, beneath the surface, Jess's parenting methods may actually point to a modern conscious strategy that challenges the old-school perceptions of parental involvement. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag defining lazy parenting. To understand the full picture, it's essential to unpack what lazy parenting means and how it relates to Jessa. Critics often see lazy parenting as a failure to enforce rules, guide children consistently, or maintain a picture-perfect household. It conjures up images of disarray, neglected responsibilities, and children left to their own devices. However, child development experts have long debated the benefits of a less rigid approach. What some label as lazy, others might recognize as trust-based or child-led parenting. It is a method that allows children to explore their environment, make choices, and learn from their actions with minimal but strategic guidance from adults. Jess's critics might post snapshots of a messy home or children playing freely as evidence of lax parenting. Yet, these moments could also showcase a mother who prioritizes emotional connection over polished appearances. This raises the question, is parenting about presenting an image of perfection, or is it about fostering a nurturing environment where children feel safe to express themselves? Hashtag, 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 the philosophy behind Jess's methods. Jessa has subtly responded to these criticisms over time, revealing more about her beliefs through interviews and candid videos. Instead of retaliating with defensive comments, she has shared snippets of her philosophy, rooted in a blend of her upbringing and her adaptations to fit the needs of her growing family. 
Growing up in a large family meant that Jessa witnessed firsthand how her mother, Michelle Duggar, managed a household that often seemed more like a small village. The buddy system used in the Duggar home placed older children in a caregiving role for their younger siblings, promoting responsibility but also creating unique dynamics in how they experience childhood. Now, as a parent herself, Jessa has carved her own path. She seems to embrace the idea that structured chaos, messes, and moments of freedom are vital parts of a child's growth. This hands-off style has roots in allowing children to develop independence, resilience, and creativity. While critics might see it as lazy, advocates would argue it's a sign of trust in her children's ability to learn naturally. The era of social media has amplified the scrutiny on parenting. For Jessa, the decision to share her life online has come with both rewards and challenges. It's a way to stay connected with fans, provide updates, and create a community. However, it also means opening up her private moments to judgment from people who don't know the full story. Photos showing toys scattered across the floor or children engaging in imaginative, and sometimes messy, play feel the lazy accusations. Yet those familiar with parenting know that such moments are common in homes with young children. What appears to be neglect could just be the reality of managing four children under the age of eight, each with their own spirited personalities and needs. For Jessa, the reality of social media criticism might also serve as a reminder of her platform's influence. She has mentioned in various posts how every mother faces challenges, and she has expressed gratitude for supportive messages she receives, highlighting the contrast between constructive conversations and the harsh judgments that so often come her way. Jessa has subtly responded to these criticisms over time, revealing more about her beliefs through interviews and candid videos. Instead of retaliating with defensive comments, she has shared snippets of her philosophy, rooted in a blend of her upbringing and her adaptations to fit the needs of her growing family. Growing up in a large family meant that Jessa witnessed firsthand how her mother, Michelle Duggar, managed a household that often seemed more like a small village. The buddy system used in the Duggar home placed older children in a caregiving role for their younger siblings, promoting responsibility but also creating unique dynamics in how they experience childhood. Now, as a parent herself, Jessa has carved her own path. She seems to embrace the idea that structured chaos, messes, and moments of freedom are vital parts of a child's growth. This hands-off style has roots in allowing children to develop independence, resilience, and creativity. While critics might see it as lazy, advocates would argue it's a sign of trust in her children's ability to learn naturally. Social Media – The Double-Edged Sword The era of social media has amplified the scrutiny on parenting. For Jessa, the decision to share her life online has come with both rewards and challenges. It's a way to stay connected with fans, provide updates, and create a community. However, it also means opening up her private moments to judgment from people who don't know the full story. Photos showing toys scattered across the floor or children engaging in imaginative, and sometimes messy, play feel the lazy accusations. Yet, those familiar with parenting know that such moments are common in homes with young children. What appears to be neglect could just be the reality of managing four children under the age of eight, each with their own spirited personalities and needs.